So I'm glad you were here because it's your senior year now, and I'm wondering, what are you thinking about doing for college? Well... So, it's my last year, and I have to be thinking of a college. There is University of Hawaii, or UC Santa Barbara. Or there could be Stanford University, or maybe San Jose State University. Did you say San Jose State? Who are you? I'm the San Jose State Fairy. Why are you here? I'm going to try to show you what a great school San Jose State is. And I'll show you the magical world of San Jose State University. Okay, let's go. Yeah. Welcome to San Jose State University, located in San Jose, California. Founded in 1857, San Jose State is the oldest public institution of higher education on the western coast. It began as a normal school that trained elementary school teachers. But over the years, it developed into a university with seven colleges that specialize in art, sciences, education, humanities, and more. Our mascot is a Spartan, and our colors are gold and blue. Over 25,000 undergrad students attend San Jose State University. There can be 20 to 45 students in a classroom, depending on the class that you are taking. Let's go to the library! That's one of the unique things here at San Jose State. Our library is eight stories high. Oh, cool. Come on, let's go see it. Okay. Is this school diverse? I'm glad you asked, Maricela. San Jose State is very diverse. There are many different types of people that come to this school. Both staff members and students. Fun things to do near San Jose State are to go and watch a San Jose Sharks hockey game, to watch a San Jose State University football game, to visit California's Great America, or to go shopping at Bay Area's Great Mall. There are many different housing options for students. Some of these options are dorm rooms on campus, apartments off campus, and the traditional staying home while going to school. Wasn't that fun? Yeah, but what are the requirements? Well, I knew you'd ask, so I made a poster. San Jose State University's required. So, Maricela, are you a resident of California? Yes, I am. Cool. Because you're a resident of California, we can look at the top chart to see your minimum eligibility requirements. So the lower the GPA is, the higher the SAT or ACT scores you would need to get in. I would love to go to San Jose State University. 